Welcome back, mathematicians. Last time we were together, we learned our doubles facts from one all the way to five. Let's look back and say them together. One plus one equals two. Two plus two equals four. Three plus three equals six. Four plus four equals eight. Five plus five equals 10. Today, we are going to learn some other doubles facts. Our learning target today is, I can solve my doubles facts from six to 10. Let's get started. Just like before, we learned that a doubles fact is when you take a number and you add it to itself. So for instance, the doubles that we learned, like four plus four equals eight. Today, we're gonna to learn some other doubles facts. Are you ready? We have our poster. I noticed that some of the answers are covered up, but today we're going to do our investigations with our counters or our cubes, and we will learn the rest of our doubles facts. Let's get started. Go ahead and get your counters or your cubes and your part part whole map. All right, guys, I'm gonna go ahead and share my screen so that you can see my manipulatives as well. So I see that I have my part, my part, and my whole. Just like before, I'm gonna give you a doubles equation and I want you to use your counters or your cubes to help you solve. Are we ready? Let's get going. Now, last time we were together, we ended with five plus five. Let's try the next one. Six plus six, because we know a double adds to itself, equals box. Using your counters or cubes, press pause and go ahead and play. As you can see on my board, I've already put my six and my six. So, hmm, I already know there's six here, so I'm not gonna write it, try to count those. I already know there's six. I'm gonna put my six and then I'm gonna count on. Six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. So six plus six equals, that's right, it equals 12. Great job, mathematicians. Clear your board and get ready for your next one. All right, mathematicians, let's try this one. Seven plus seven equals box. What is seven plus seven? Try on your own, and when you're ready, hit play. Wow, I heard some great thinking. Let's try our counting on again. I know that this is seven, so I'm not gonna count it. I already know there's seven there, but I am gonna count on to help me find my answer. Seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So seven plus seven must equal 14. Wonderful thinking. I noticed that some of us are still thinking about counting all of the counters together. And that if that's where you are, then that is perfectly fine. But as we go, I want you to try and build your fact fluency by counting on. So make sure if you know that that number is, go ahead and say it and then try to count on. You can also write on your mat, just like I did to help you. Let's get ready for our next one. Clear your board. All right, mathematicians, let's try our next one. Eight plus eight equals blank. Using your tools, see if you can figure out eight plus eight. Press pause, and when you're ready, hit play. Did you get your counters out like I did? Let's see what we've got. Again, I know this is eight, 
so I don't have to key on it again. I'm just going to write an eight. And then I'm going to count on eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So eight plus eight is 16. Wonderful thinking. Wow, we're getting into some higher numbers. Clear your board. Let's go to our next one. All right, mathematicians. Now we're up to nine. Nine plus nine equals blank. Nine plus nine equals blank. Using your tools, Solve it and hit play when you're ready. Oh my, if your board looks anything like mine, it's getting pretty full. Again, I know that this is what number, guys? That's right, it's nine. So I don't need to count those because I already know it's nine. Now I can count on to see what nine plus nine equals. Count with me, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18. Nine plus nine equals 18. Wonderful thinking. Wow, we're learning a lot of math facts today. Let's try our next one. Clear your board and get ready. Let's try this one. 10 plus 10. Wow, those are some big numbers. 10 plus 10. Hit pause, use your tools, and hit play when you're ready. Wow, my part part home ad is sure filling up. Let's see. I know that there is what number on this side? 10. So I'm going to think 10 and count on. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, and 20. 10 plus 10 is 20. Great jobs, mathematicians. We have been doing a lot of fact practice today. Let's see how we did. When you're ready, raise your hand to give the answer. Six plus six is 12. Great thinking. Seven plus seven is, that's right, 14. Eight plus eight is, that's right, 16. Nine plus nine is, 18. And our last one, 10 plus 10 is 20. So we know our doubles facts from one plus one all the way to 10 plus 10. Let's check our doubles wrap and see if we've got it down. Now, you are welcome to join me in saying our doubles facts. This is our doubles wrap. It's the doubles, baby. Let's go, let's go. It's the doubles, baby, and we start with zero. Zero plus zero equals zero. Oh, one plus one equals two. Ooh, two plus two equals four. More, three plus three equals six. Kicks, four plus four equals eight. That's great. Five plus five equals 10. Again, six plus six equals 12. That's swell. Seven plus seven equals 14. Let's, let's lean. 
Eight plus eight equals 16, you're a queen. Nine plus nine equals 18, jelly bean. 10 plus 10, let's do it all again. Great job saying our doubles wrap. As we learn, we'll get better and better at our doubles. Are you ready for some fun? I have a special video that's gonna help us learn our doubles facts from six to 10. Get ready. Sing along. Doubles, I can add doubles. It's no trouble for me to add doubles. Doubles, doubles, I can add doubles. It's no trouble for me to add doubles. Get ready. Sing along if you know it. Six equals twelve. Seven plus seven equals fourteen. Eight plus eight. Equals sixteen. Nine plus nine equals eighteen. Ten plus ten equals twenty. Bruh, bruh, double up. Bruh. Doubles, doubles. I can add doubles. It's no trouble for me to add doubles. Doubles, doubles. I can add doubles. It's no trouble for me to add doubles. Ready. Six equals twelve. Seven plus seven equals fourteen. Eight plus eight equals sixteen. Nine plus nine equals eighteen. Ten plus ten equals twenty. Bruh, bruh, double up, bruh. Doubles, doubles. I can add doubles. It's no trouble for me to add doubles. Doubles, doubles. I can add doubles. It's no trouble for me to add doubles. Monster Math presents Addition Below 10. Okay, class, let's All begin. Right, guys. What is Great 5 job. plus 3? Ready to try it one more time? I know I am. Let's see. I want to hear you singing this time. Doubles, it's no trouble for me to add doubles. Doubles, doubles, I can add doubles. It's no trouble for me to add doubles. If you know it, sing along. Six equals twelve. Seven plus seven equals fourteen. Eight plus eight. Equals sixteen. Nine plus nine. Equals eighteen. Ten plus ten. Equals twenty. Bruh, bruh, double up. Bruh. Doubles, doubles. I can add doubles. It's no trouble for me to add doubles. Doubles, doubles. I can add doubles. It's no trouble for me to add doubles. Six equals twelve. Seven plus seven equals fourteen. Eight plus eight equals sixteen. Nine plus nine equals eighteen. Ten plus ten equals twenty. Bruh, bruh, double up. Bruh. Doubles, doubles. I can add doubles. It's no trouble for me to add doubles. Doubles, doubles. I can add doubles. It's no trouble for me to add doubles. Great job, guys. Monster Math presents. Oh, sorry about that. Sometimes those things get away from me. So we have learned our doubles facts all the way from zero plus zero all the way to 10 plus 10. We've done some great thinking today. I've noticed something very interesting about my doubles facts. If I look at my answers, I can count them by twos because a doubles fact are all even sums. That's right. You can count the sums of a doubles fact by twos. Let's try. If I just look at my answers, I can see that my answers, which are our sums, count by twos. You ready? Two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 
16, 18, 20. The reason you can count it by twos is because they are even numbers. When you add a number to itself, it creates an even number. I thought that was a very interesting fact about our doubles. I have a new game that I want to introduce you to. It's called Doubles Aren't Trouble. Are they trouble? Nah, they're pretty easy to learn and we'll get better at them as we practice. I'm gonna go ahead and share my screen so that you can see the game. Now I have a die with me so I can roll my dice. Your job is to help me to answer the question. Let's see. On that screen, you're going to see a game board that says doubles aren't trouble. When you play this game, you can use two die or you can just use one die. I would recommend rolling one die. So if I roll my dice, I rolled a four. Hmm, I have to think about my doubles fact. What is four? plus four. Raise your hand when you know the answer. Great, four plus four is eight. So I can cover up my eight. If I was playing with a partner, now it would be my partner's turn. We roll the die. This time I landed on a six. Hmm, what is six plus six? Raise your hand when you know the answer. That's right, it's 12. Let's do one more, or actually two more. Hmm, let me roll my dice. I got a five. What is five plus five? That's right, it's 10. My partner's turn. Let's see. Oh, they rolled a three. So what is three plus three? That's right, it's six. So the point of our game is to learn our doubles facts. When we fill up all of our sheet, we can play again. To play, you have counters, you roll one die, and you double the amount. You can see the die examples at the top. Once you roll your die, double your number. If you roll a four, then your question is four plus four. If you roll a six, then your question is six plus six. And that is how you play Doubles Aren't Trouble. I hope you get a chance to play that game and practice your fact fluency with your doubles. I'll see you next time. Bye guys.